Since 1971, as the supply of money in the global financial system has continually increased through money printing, backed by nothing more than a paper promise of repayment, so has the cost of buying a home. That's what broken money does to a society, when inflation, which is defined as the expansion in the supply of money, combines with decades of low interest rate policies where taking on debt is normalized, assets like real estate become savings instruments and their prices reflect this store of value premium far above their utility value. Real estate is the number one store of value in the world. There's around 330 trillion US dollars of global worth invested into real estate. That's around 67% of global wealth. We own more houses, not because of the utility value. We own more houses because our money is getting worth less and we're gonna pay it back in cheaper nominal terms.